What is up, everypony? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome to AU Friday. This is the first ever AU Friday on the channel, as a matter of fact. Because in case you guys didn't see the post from a little bit ago, I made a post saying if this post reached, if I'm correct, 300 to 400 likes, I would start doing something called AU Friday, and I would be doing AUs every single Friday, at least until the AUs are completely gone. And I plan on doing a few, but I came across a relatively short one today that I actually liked quite recently, and it looked really interesting. So I decided I'm going to take a look at it today. As you can see, we are on Apple Bytes page. They have about 453 followers, and they only got two slides so far. But we're going to take a look and see how the story starts, and hopefully it'll give them a boost to give them motivation to create more going forward. But let's take a look. Ooh. Ah, thank you. Thank you, Verizon. Best internet. Best internet. <sighs> Giving me a black screen and immediately switching over. My Little Pony, Blood Apple Disease. Pre-infection. The pony lives a normal life, unsuspected of the virus. First signs of infection. The pony comes in contact with the virus through apples or other infected. Weird. First signs of infection. The pony starts to have a sore, itchy throat, bloodshot eyes, and back pain. First signs of infection. The pony grows a pair of fangs. Eyes dilate and turn red. They feel sensitive to the sun and garlic gives them an allergic reaction. Pony feels always thirsty, so it's kind of like a vampire-like disease, I guess. Late signs of infection. The ponies back start growing a weird nub slash bump. Their eyes are fully dilated and red. They feel weaker and slight burn in the sun. Garlic is weakening and they are bloodthirsty. So yeah, they become vampires. Pretty much. Full stage of infection. The pony has grown a pair of bat wings. They become hostile and extremely bloodthirsty. Faster in the night and slower at daytime. So, basically, they kind of just turn into vampire ponies, or like bat ponies, pretty much, but with kind of an evil, like an evil side of things, like they become hostile, pretty much, so I guess that's kind of unique. We haven't really seen anything where they turn into like full-on vampire-like creatures yet, so this one's quite interesting, has a, has a lovely start, and I can see we got little Octavia down here giving us examples of the virus, so let's move on to, to the final slide and see what we're working with here. My Little Pony Blood Apple Disease. Prologue. So we got Applejack looking at a suspiciously delicious apple. I don't know. I don't know. I was thinking of a word that would make sense with that, but unfortunately I couldn't think of anything that would have been hilarious. But this apple looks a little different. Um, I'm looking at the shades of the apples. I think it might be like a shade darker, maybe like a tiny bit, but I'm not sure. These bats are probably back. Darn it. Uh-oh. Munch, munch. So the first victim is Colgate. Lovely. They gotta get the toothpaste pony. These apples are not at all good today. <laughs> oh, poor, poor toothpaste or poor Colgate. So that's all we got from this is we don't really see much of an update, but this was made on the 8th, uh, the 8th of June. So, hopefully more comes out. I'm hoping they didn't just drop it, because it has a good base. It has a good start to it. And I'd love to see where it would go further. But, of course, you also got to take into account that they could be busy with their personal life. And maybe creating an AU takes a bit more time than what they'd want. So, maybe we just got to give them time. Hopefully more episodes will come out in the future. Uh, this will be linked in the description in case you guys want to check it out for yourself. It is pretty good. A nice little start to an AU. Hopefully we just get more to go off of in the future and the story gets better and better. But only time will tell. So yeah, this was the blood apple disease, which pretty much turns the ponies into vampire bats with evil tendencies, with hostility. And they're pretty much just evil when the virus fully kicks in, or the disease, I guess you could say. But yeah, sorry that it was a little short today. I was running out of time. I've been busy all day, and I've learned some interesting information that I will release on Sunday about myself, and it is not great information. 
But I also have a video scheduled for tomorrow that I'm looking forward to doing. We got a new video that was uploaded from Mayhem Town today, so hopefully we get to check that out tomorrow. Make sure to tune in for the newest HD video coming out. <laughs> but yeah, thanks for watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe if you enjoyed. Dislike if you didn't. It's completely fine either way, and that's all I gotta say. So thanks for watching, and I will see you all in the next video. Peace. Silver 03 Shots outside, I'll show you why I can't know if you're talking, I prefer to move side Cause the pussy ass gay, you don't count some pride Oh, ha, 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 don't die And I tell her that I love her, why fuck, I'm lying Together we'll make this perfect timing